Alrighty then, everybody, it's time for the last episode in the intensive care unit, or yeah, whatever it's called. We are on level 49, final hope. Keep applying the medication to Matilda during the day. So this will save mom? There's a good chance that it will. You'll have to keep administering the live acts throughout the day. This has got to work. I'm sure it will. Yeah, I was like, don't you have a job? Shouldn't you go to your job, Daniel? What? <laughs> like, dude. Oh, wow. That is a strange coffee machine. Okay. Okay. Oh, it's one of these. I see. I see. Oh, ah.
don't know what happened there. Oh, oh, shit, oh, shit, oh, shit, oh, shit. Oh. Huh. <gasps> Damn. Focus. Okay. Shift left, I should say. Oh. Oh. Ah. Right, we're almost done. Alright, here we go. Now the waiting starts. Do you guys want anything to drink?
What's happening? Nothing good. Her hormones levels are through the roof and her liver's failing! Somehow the medication only made things worse. But that's impossible. What do we do now? We either find the cause or... Let's just say we need to find the cause. Challenge 25, janitor jokes. The janitor is joking around with the chair, so keep cl a close eye on them. What? <laughs> what? Oh. 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 Alright, fine. I thought maybe they meant that you had to remember where they oh. were originally, oh. but that was not the point. Okay, cool. This is fine. Ah! Uh, you're not funny! It's not just joking around with the chairs, you're literally moving patients! Or visitors, whatever. And the fact that the screen goes black makes me think that... <laughs> the game... <laughs> dies. Which is not good. You ain't funny. I, 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 it makes me panic every time the screen goes black. Stop! I'm like, no! No, don't die on me, game! This is a horrible level. I hate you. We're gonna need a lot of tissues, basically, oh. that's it. I like how the patients are like, No, 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 I'm requesting a specific seat. Not, I'm not here to, like, see a specific person. I'm here to <laughs> sit in a specific seat. <laughs> That's the point of my being here. <laughs> it's like, okay. Listen to the angry.
So that was horrible, on purpose, but still. Level 50, the last intensive care level. The time is now, prepare Matilda for surgery. Sophia, how long do we have to find out what's wrong? I'd say 24 hours max. 24 hours?! But a whole range of doctors has been trying to figure out what's wrong with her for the better part of a year already! This will never... You guys will ne- Oh no, he's having those episodes as well. Ryan? Ryan? But... If Ryan has these types of episodes too... They can't be psychological! They- they're hereditary! And those episodes come from the brain, not the circulatory system. Huh? What happened? You had an episode, like mom used to have. And that might actually help us find out what's wrong with her. Hmm, so the symptoms are stress-induced episodes, increased hormone levels, kidney failure, liver failure, and it's hereditary. Hmm, it couldn't be paragensis, because it, that doesn't increase hormone levels. Allison. Give me a second, I'm thinking. Allison, it's... It's advanced Herkin's disorder. It... It's advanced Herkin's disorder. Can someone tell me what advanced Herkin's disorder is? Herkins is a hereditary brain mutation in which the brain creates thick extra pathways, mostly connected to emotional trauma. Those pathways can interfere with any part of the brain and can cause anything from mood swings to motor issues and even mental disabilities. Once it gets to the advanced stages, the trauma becomes irrelevant. Survival chances drop close to zero. And to treat it, you need a top-tier surgeon to perform conscious brain surgery. Well, you certainly have one of those. You'd do that for us? I would, but we do have a bigger problem. Yesterday, our neuroendoscope was sold to Queensboro. And we need to start the operation ASAP if we want to have any chance of success. I still have some connections with our helicopter pilot through Joe. Well, Sophia preps your mother for surgery and you can fly to Queensboro. I'll get the OR ready. Well, Daniel works at Queensboro. That's enough of that. Now get going. No, seriously, don't hug people who don't like hugs. However nicely you mean it. Just respect boundaries, please. 
Ryan, can you go see Connor today and fill him in? Don't you worry, Miss Hart. Your daughter is going to save you. Welcome to the shop. We shall buy last thingies. I think this is all. Oh, all right then. Let's get this show on the road. I'm happy to be playing Sophia. Still don't know why there's a photo of Jenny like that, but oh. okay. Oh. I heard it. There. Nah, I can't believe I saw that. I was like, I promise oh, I heard him from oh. the left. Uh-oh. 
Completed your internship at the intensive care unit. Whee! New episodes. Psychiatry, psychiatry. I'm not really sure how to pronounce it exactly, but yeah. You'll get to treat patients with Sam. Don't forget to join our Facebook page. Blah, blah, blah. Is she good to go? She is. I just hope Allison gets back in time. <sighs> That's why it all burnt down! Thanks to Victor! I say thanks ironically because of Victor. Did. Ah, she missed the flames. She not dead. She's not even hurt, is she? Superwoman. Well, maybe a little bit. Well, she fell hard if she made that big of a crack on the flower. I'm not sure this is the best place in to operate someone, but oh. Hello. Allie, you can't be here! You need to go! Quinn explained everything to me. Ch chances are I'll die either way, but you can still live! She's right, Allison. The fire's spreading too quickly. There's just no way we can finish the operation in time. I'm afraid we can't move her in her state. No. I'm not leaving. Allie, you have to. I can't be the one who puts you in danger all over again. Mom, don't you see that this isn't your choice to make? I've run away from enough of my problems. Allie, I'm not going Anywhere. This won't be the same as reading it in the book, Allison. But I know you covered this in med school. I- <coughs> I'll go get help! Wait, uh, Quinn, 
Oh, okay. Uh, I guess. Oh, a conscious operation. That's looks like Quinn has already started removing the skull cap. Let's continue drilling away part of the skull to expose the brain. I will also I also want to put like to point out that you can actually from what I know you can do this with a conscious person because they don't you don't actually feel any pain like the brain and the skull, obviously the bones, and the brain itself has no uh, pain recept nerves, whatever. Your brain can actually never hurt, even though a headache feels like it, because it has no pain receptors. A headache is like, you feel it in the skin or whatever, it is around the head, whatever. The brain has no pain receptors whatsoever. So you're not gonna feel pain, at least. I don't know if you feel anything, but probably do, but anyways. So far so good. Now we're carefully going to remove the bone. Yes! Now, let's use the spotting fluid on the entire surface. Well, that's everything. Now we just need to wait for the problem areas to show up on our scanner. Come on! Yes! Those... Those pathways are pretty big. I just... If just one of these cuts breaks the barrier of the pathway, my mom... She'll... Frankly, she'll die anyway. This is like the only way of like three different scenarios that she could possibly survive. <sighs> Don't think about it, Allison. Okay, mom. After each cut, I'm going to need you to perform a little task. Oh yeah, that's what they do when you're conscious, so you they'll, they check that nothing vital in the brain has been damaged, that you can do certain tasks. Mom, can you talk to me for a bit? I... I came to visit you once, you know? What? After I hadn't had an episode for... Blah, after I hadn't had any episodes for a year. You were outside, goofing around with your grandpa. The two of you looked so happy. I didn't want to ruin that. I... I'm so sorry I left you, Allie. Maybe not the situation to be talking about this. On the other hand, you could die any at any point, so I understand. It's okay now, Mom. But... Maybe we shouldn't talk about things that will have us both in tears? Shit, Allison! You can still leave, Allison! We had this conversation, Mom. I'm not leaving here without you. Your brain fucking exposed. Nope, I just realized what I said, sorry. <laughs> Darn it! Mom, can you squeeze your hand into a fist and then stretch out all your fingers? Yes. Yes, I can. But, Allison, I don't feel so good. Of course not, you're breathing in smoke and... Crap. We don't have much time left. I need to remove the pathway that's causing the increase in hormones. Mom? No time to waste. I guess I'll have to do this blind. Come on, Mom. Stay with me. We're almost there. Done. Please hang in there. Uh, Ali? Mom! Just let me staple this up and we can go. Ali! Mom, I have to finish this up before we can go.
Why are we zooming in? Why are we zooming in? Why are we zooming in, game? I did it! I saved! I can open the you. Jesus? No, it's just Daniel. <laughs> Thanks, Daniel. I'm not going anywhere. You've become such an amazing woman. We have to go, Allison. Take good care of her, okay? Do you think we'll recover from this? Losing Little Creek? Losing our family hospital? Take a look around, Daniel. The entire family's here. Everybody's safe. We're all together. You're right. We'll be okay. Hope no patients died in there. So I wonder whose fault this is? Hmm. Maybe Victor? We're going to have to talk about it, though. What? Well, you just ran into a burning building to save me. Hey, you went in there first. Fair enough. But there are easier ways of telling me you love me, you know? What? I... I... Okay, see, now Allison's kissing Daniel. I still feel like they're a little too much emotion and not enough stability, but maybe they can find the stability to have an actual functioning relationship. I don't know. Anyways, that was that. So next time, I guess we're jumping a bit and uh, Allison's back interning at psychiatry, I, I guess. Um, but yeah, thank you all very much for watching and I'll see ya.